Welcome to the VibeDAC Base System Overview. During this demo, you will learn about vibration monitoring and the VibeDAC 4 channel base system. VibeDAC is a tool for vibration data acquisition, analysis, and logging. It is based on National Instruments' LabVIEW programming language and commercial off the shelf hardware. While there are many VibeDAC system options, this flash demo presents the portable, low cost base system, which can support up to four channels of physical sensors, including accelerometers, tachometers, proximity probes, and many more. VibeDAC customers include companies that manufacture, own, or maintain equipment whose health can be determined through the analysis of vibration signatures. Vibration monitoring techniques can be applied to a wide variety of machinery across industries. Testing and analysis may need to be carried out during the design of new machinery, during the manufacturing process, or during normal operation to continually assess health. Additionally, Vibration monitoring tools and techniques can be used to measure environmental vibrations. There are examples of this across many industries. Semiconductor manufacturing facilities must be evaluated to avoid process disturbances. In healthcare facilities, precision equipment must be isolated to ensure the proper operation. In building and construction, work sites must be monitored to prevent damage to surrounding structures. These are just a few of the potential applications. Our clients choose VibeDAC for a variety of reasons. All of them need a solution for condition monitoring and vibration analysis. Most clients want a turnkey solution where they don't need to write software from scratch. The solution needs to be easy to use so that they can configure and acquire data in minutes. Often, they like commercial off-the-shelf components such as National Instruments' data acquisition cards. Our base system utilizes USB hardware for ease of use and portability. Though our VibeDAC system is a turnkey application, our customers appreciate knowing that it is built in LabVIEW and can be personalized for their needs when custom functionality is necessary. Finally, clients like knowing that we can train their staff to use the product and even offer services to integrate VibeDAC with other data acquisition systems. The VibeDAC base system includes VibeDAC transient software. This PC-based application allows you to easily configure your system and begin acquiring data. Logging can be carried out at user-defined intervals and previously recorded data can be played back. Advanced algorithms are used to process the acquired data and deliver meaningful results. Powerful plotting tools allow you to view a wide variety of vibration plots including time domain, frequency spectrum, waterfall, Bode, polar, shaft center line, trend, and feature table. Any number of plots can be viewed in floating windows. Also included with the base system is a USB data acquisition module. This hardware allows you to acquire four channels of simultaneously sampled data at acquisition rates of up to 51.2 kHz. Each channel offers 24 bits of resolution and incorporates an anti-aliasing filter. AC-DC coupling and IE-PE power can be turned on or off on a per channel basis. Best of all, the VibeDAC base system offers you all these features at a significantly lower cost than the competition. Let's show you what VibeDAC looks like when it's actually running. We begin here on the VibeDAC main screen. It's possible to load and save configurations, but let's start off by configuring the system from scratch. The first thing we will want to do is go to the system settings section of the main window to configure a variety of system-wide settings. One of our initial settings is the data log file directory. We'll also set some perimeters related to order tracking so that we can determine the magnitude and phase of input vibrations as a function of tachometer speed, which can be a very useful analysis tool. Another group of settings deal with FFTs and displaying data in the frequency domain. Some of those include number of lines, averages, and max frequency to show on spectrum plots. Finally, we'll set some parameters to define how often we will write data to log files. We can specify log intervals in terms of changes in time or changes in RPM. Now that we've configured our system-wide settings, we're going to configure our input channels. Here, we'll enter a name for each hardware channel that we want to acquire data on. There are a variety of configuration options for the input channels, including display units, sensitivities, AC or DC coupling, and IEPE, to provide excitation currents to accelerometers if needed. Once hardware input channels have been defined, we can group sensors located at the same point on our machinery into pairs. 
These pairs can be used for certain plots like orbits or shaft center lines for insight into the two-dimensional motion of our machinery at that point. So now that we have fully configured our system, we can go ahead and press the play button to begin acquiring data. The plot manager section on our main user interface allows us to open plots and view data. A plot configuration dialog allows us to choose the plot type and configuration viewing options. First I will open up a feature table plot. With this plot open, we get general summary information about what is going on with our system. We can also see, back on the main screen, the RPM indicator showing the speed of our tachometer. Next I will open a time domain plot to view the signal being acquired on channel 2. Once open, I can resize the window, view some summary data to the right of the plot, and probe to find specific values. I can always bring up the plot configuration dialog to change settings such as axis scaling. Another key plot to view is an FFT so that I can see my vibration data in the frequency domain. Looking once again at channel 2, I can see which frequencies are most prevalent in my vibration signal. This provides me with a lot of insight into what might be causing vibration in my system. The VibeDAC base system price is $45.97 and includes USB acquisition hardware and the VibeDAC transient software application. Delivery is typically two to four weeks. Calbay Systems can provide the entire system, including the PC, sensors, and cables, or just the data acquisition hardware and software. Let's talk about training on VibeDAC. A full user manual is included with a VibeDAC application. Our company is constantly working to produce new flash demos, such as the one you are watching. Basic training programs can be carried out through a live web conference where our engineers can instruct you on the configuration and use of your VibeDAC system. If desired, customized trainings programs can be carried out at your facility for individuals or groups. This presentation is specific to the VibeDAC base system, but CalBay also offers many more turnkey systems and custom solutions. Other VibeDAC systems are available for applications requiring higher channel counts, advanced data management, embedded installation, and much more. If none of our turnkey systems meet your needs, CalBay Systems has 17 years of experience in the design and development of custom measurement and automation systems. We have successfully provided solutions for jet engine test, bearing test, fan balance, turbine test, pump test, and numerous other applications. To find out more about VibeDAC and CalBay, please check out our websites at www.vibedac.com and www.calbay.com or feel free to contact us using the information shown here. Get more for your money at vibedac.com.